It's time to take a look at the top headlines from around the world with our Paul Yi. Our focus today, police in Brazil crack down on corrupt politics. Mexico faces a water crisis after a massive oil spill and China endures its worst sandstorm in over a decade. Right, uh, corruption scandals outside of Korea. Paul, let's start off in Brazil. President Dilma Rousseff's ruling party has been embroiled in a billion-dollar corruption scandal. And now one of her party's top officials has been brought up on grave charges. That's right. João Vacari, the chief treasurer of Brazil's Workers' Party, has been indicted and charged with accepting political kickbacks and money laundering. Police on Wednesday arrested Vicari and his home in Sao Paulo. A federal judge had ordered Vicari's arrest after five suspects testified against him in a plea bargain deal. Prosecutors allege the official stole up to 200 million U.S. dollars from government projects. We discovered that Vicari has a history of carrying out these sorts of operations since 2004, and we discovered that his family has been involved in several suspect operations, which are being investigated. Relatively significant amounts of money were found to have been transferred to family members. At the center of the corruption allegations is the state-run oil company Petrobras, which is accused of stealing billions of dollars of taxpayer funds. President Rousseff has denied any knowledge of the scandal while she was serving as chairwoman of the oil firm. This says anti-government protests have erupted across the country in recent months, with the public calling for her impeachment.